Hello and welcome to Ask Liebs. I'm Lieberman. Got an email today from a Lieber friend. Her fiance broke up with her, broke off their engagement, then wound up with somebody else, changed his mind, said, come back, be with me, let's be together. They were together like maybe 10 days and then he broke it off again. All together, bad situation, she feels shitty. Her family now hates him for what he did, and quite rightly. The thing is, she's still in love with him. He makes her happy, she wants to be with him. It's important to note that he's got PTSD, depression, and anxiety from being being in the army. She still wants to be with him. What should she do? How can she get over him? She feels like her life is over. First of all, Lieber friend, I am sorry about what happened to your engagement. It's an incredibly sudden thing. It's an incredibly painful thing. It's something that no one sees coming. Once you get engaged, you think at the very least we're gonna get married. Hopefully things work out. And you know, it's the guy you love. Of course you wanna be with him. You say that he makes you happy. It sounds like he is not in a position to make you happy in the long term. It is entirely possible that he can't handle a marriage or that failing you and failing that relationship is such a scary present thought in his head that it's easier to not do it and try to just keep on moving. Whether or not he loves you or as he said when he was breaking up with you, he just lusted after you, it almost doesn't matter to me, just from the way that this thing is framed, and I'll explain in a second. Whether or not he really still loves you, or just lusted after you as he told you, which probably is bullshit, it sounds like he's deeply conflicted over what he wants, and frankly doesn't know. In my mind, that does not make him a good candidate for marriage, and definitely not somebody who's gonna be able to deliver happiness over many, many years together. He's gotta figure his shit out, and that could take years. And also, you're both very young, maybe he still just wants to date around, maybe he doesn't wanna be tied down, or maybe he doesn't think he's good enough for you. Regardless of what the explanation is, because it honestly could be anything, he's a bad bet. It's hard to hear, and I am sorry that I have to say it, but you should want for yourself to be with somebody for whom you are the only option and the only answer and would not ask you to marry them unless they were sure. It's a really shitty thing to ask someone to marry them and then back out twice. It's really shitty. And it means that he doesn't have a ton of respect for the institution of marriage. Now, again, I don't know this guy. I don't know his problems. And maybe he does make you very, very happy. What you are telling me here says that he is not mature enough to handle what you require and what you deserve from a partner. That doesn't mean that it's gonna hurt any less or that you're wrong for having feelings for him or that I judge you for still loving this guy despite what he did. I don't think I would have given him a second chance. Also, real quick, he starts dating somebody else three weeks after he breaks off your engagement. Then a month or so into dating that girl, he's talking to you saying he's gonna break up with that girl, he made a mistake. That to me is the clearest illustration of not knowing what he wants, because then he went back to that girl who for some reason took him back. I, I, crazy. I 100% do not believe that he told you the truth about why he broke off this engagement, which means that he doesn't respect you very much. Because if he did respect and love you, he would tell you the truth because you need to hear it. Two. He doesn't respect this other girl, which means that maybe he just doesn't have it in him to respect the people that he's with. And maybe that has something to do with his lingering anxiety, depression, PTSD. He can't fully give himself to another person. As sad as it is to say, and I'm sorry that I, a stranger, am the one who has to say it, I don't think your marriage would have worked out. And I think that ultimately things work out for a reason and this worked out better for you in the long run. I am sorry, and I know that is not what you wanna hear, and you probably do not want to believe me, but I believe with all of my heart that this is the best way that things could have gone down. I hope that you find somebody who treats you with love and respect in a way that this guy did and does not. I am sorry that you are going through it. I do believe with all of my heart that this is how things were supposed to go, and I hope that you are able to find somebody who really gives you all of the respect and love you deserve. I wish you all the best. Folks, that's gonna be the video for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave me a comment. Let me know what you thought. I'm Lieberman. I'll see you 